the good people of Newfoundland, the Wheels for Wishes, um, they're not going to have their car show this year, but they want to have a virtual car show and show your car on the camera and put it on the computer. And uh, they want to raise money to get a puppy dog or a dog, probably a trained dog, for a blind child. What a great thing to do, eh? Um, me and Jolene were sitting down for a minute thinking about how would you stimulate someone without that sense. And uh, it's a hard one, you know? But uh, as I walk around this car, I'm gonna try to explain it as the best I can, because I don't know everything about it. I just know what I like. And uh, me and Jolene bought this car after our first season. We put our coins together. We, uh, we thought that this would be a good bang for our buck. It's a 300 ZX and it's 1990. Now, I remember this car as a young person and uh, it was something else. It just looked so sleek. You know, it looked like it was going fast without even, without even uh, seeing it go by. But as I look at the car, um, it's mostly original. Everything's original on it. It seems to be like the original, it's got the original texture down bottom, the rock guard on the bottom. Uh, all the interior is original. I don't, the tires are not original. Uh, the exhaust he switched out, he made, he put a different exhaust on, but we still have the original exhaust for it. It's a twin turbo, so this car, uh, it, rock and roll, it rocks and rolls pretty good. Uh, it's an automatic, we really enjoy that. We can spend our time driving it instead of shifting it. Uh, we don't even have to open the hood yet. That'd be the bad boy there. It's very clean. Um, I enjoyed that. It's funny how I am the kind of guy that rips and tears everything apart and makes something crazy of the things, but yet when I buy something, when I spend my money or spend Jolene's money, uh, we like to buy something that's all original, like sort of. Just, I don't know. Um, it's nice to know the truth about the car. The only thing I've seen that I didn't like underneath the hood or I say I don't like, I don't say things I don't. That's what we should not do say the things we don't like. Let's all talk about the things we do like. Well, I like it that it's got a twin turbo. I like that it's automatic, that we get to drive. I like how clean it is inside the hood and all that, or inside here, it's never been messed with. All the stickers are still there. All everything's still in place. It's just really a fantastic car. If you walk around it there, Jolene, I'll open the door. You can come back, you can come back, just pass me there and we'll open the door. This is what it looks like inside. See, you can get the excellence in quality, certified by Nissan. Yeah, we do the exact same thing here. We get curb and gutter. When you get to the curb, you gutter. <laughs> yeah, we enjoy the automatic. Or I do anyways. Uh, I, I, what I'm told, it has an original spoiler on it and stuff. I, I guess that makes it too. It, it is the twin turbo. We have the original exhaust pipes in the back. And this is an antique now. This is 1990, we're at 2020. I think everybody knows that year and everybody will not forget it. But what I will say is that we uh, we enjoy all the cars here at Hills Auto. We enjoy every car that is an antique. And we enjoy it because we understand, I understand that someone has a passion for that car and they have the exact same feeling that I have for my cars. So I relate very well. So as I walk around this car, you know, it might not be some, be some people's taste, but it is for a lot of other people. So you have to respect that, you know, as a car person. Let's take it for a little spin there, baby. Please. You wanna get in the other side? See if I can get these big boots in there. Get that seat jammed head, haven't you? Yeah. Huh? These little cars, um, the best way to get in is exactly like a hot rod that we build. Ass first. Yeah, ass first. Ass first. I don't know where everything is on this car, so forgive me. 122,000 kilometers on it. Um, oil pressure's almost halfway. We're minus on the turbo thing there, but that's fine. We're not going anywhere right yet. As I put that seat belt on, I've noticed I've gained a little bit of weight. I need to go back to work. Get what I'm 
saying? <laughs> you get what I'm saying? Let's take a little spin down here. I don't want to go crazy, but let's step on it. Oh, that's a good feeling. That feels like an airplane. You know what I'm saying? We take off an airplane, I'll let off that a little too fast. But it has good pull on it. Um, you can notice the turbo thing coming up too. It's kind of fun. Um, that was not even barely touching it, but what a nice little car to drive in town, eh? You can take the T-tops out, put the windows down. I'm not shifting all the time because I'm at the lights and I'm not interested in getting in trouble really anymore. I'm not interested in that anymore. Uh, this is Jolene's, I would say it's Jolene's collector car. Um, it fits her nicely. Remember, Ken had one. He stole Barbie away from, no, G.I. Joe had one. Sorry, excuse me, G.I. Joe had one. He stole Barbie away from Ken. Doesn't say it's a good thing, but it says how good the car is. Doesn't it, huh? You know what I'm saying? I just thought that was funny. That's not a good thing. It just says how good the car is. I'm gonna step on it. Here we go, huh? We're taking a hard right, we're at 2,300 feet. Please keep your seatbelt on. We are coming to a slow area. Yeah, very good feeling. Do not be scared to share a video about your car. Let's help that child out and get that dog for that child. That'd be a great thing. Looks good on you, Wheels for Wishes. Glad to help. 